Hello. In this video, I am going to demonstrate how a progressive web application made with React can become your go-to secure web and mobile application. Using the FIDO2 WebAuthn framework, securing your application is now just a breeze. But first, what is a PWA? A progressive web app is a type of application designed to work seamlessly across all devices, acting as both a web and mobile app. Developed using common web technologies like HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, PWAs offer an app-like experience directly from a web browser without the need for downloading from app stores. They are highly responsive, ensuring compatibility with any screen size and device type. One of the key features of PWAs is their ability to function offline or on low-quality networks, thanks to the use of service workers for background tasks. A PWA can be packaged within a native wrapper for distribution on platforms like iOS, Android, Windows, and the MetaQuest Store, although it remains fundamentally a web application. PWAs require only web development expertise, making it more economical and efficient to find and employ developers, as web developers are more readily available compared to specialized native app developers. For our demonstration, I created a React web application that I turned into a PWA with a secured registration and authentication using the FIDO2 framework WebAuthn. FIDO2 is a set of security standards that provides a more secure, passwordless method of authentication using hardware devices for safer access to online services. For presentation purposes, the e-banking authentication in this example is simplified to WebAuthn. However, for typical e-banking applications, implementing a two-factor authentication is strongly recommended. Let's dive in by registering ourselves using WebAuthn. After typing in our username, the registering process on iOS will get us through a Face ID sign-in. The method of our registration depends on the device you are authenticating from. For example, a FIDO security USB key, a Windows PIN, or in our case, an iCloud keychain passkey. Registering will store the passkey for our username, Francois, in the iCloud keychain. Once done, we can now authenticate with the method we registered with. We are now securely logged to our eBanking PWA. In this example and for UI performance demonstration, the application loads a 10,000s entry JSON of banking transactions that runs perfectly smoothly. But for obvious reasons, it would be better to paginate our request on scroll for a better user experience. PWAs can access native cell phone APIs, such as using both cameras, geolocation, notifications, vibrations, Bluetooth, NFC, payment, and many more. Let's demonstrate the use of the media capture. In our e-banking application, a classic case would be sending money to someone by scanning their QR code. Our iPhone asks for permission, we flash it, the recipient is found, and transfer ready to be made. In our e-banking case, accessing our location remains as easy as authorizing it from a browser or a native app. Here's the list of surrounding banks around my position. This sums up our presentation for the WebAuth NPWA application. Thank you for watching.